Genesis chapter 36. These are the descendants of Esau, that is Edo. Esau took his wives from the Canaanites, Ada, daughter of Elon, the Hittite, Aholibama, daughter of Anna, son of Sibion, the Hivite, and Basemuth, Ishmael's daughter, sister of Nabaiot, Ada bore Eliphaz to Esau, Basemuth bore Reuel, and Aholibama bore Jehosh, Jalam, and Korah. These are the sons of Esau who were born to him in the land of Canaan. Then Esau took his wives, his sons, his daughters, and all the members of his household, his cattle, all his livestock, and all the property he had acquired in the land of Canaan. And he moved to a land some distance from his brother Jacob, for their possessions were too great for them to live together. The land where they were staying could not support them because of their livestock. So Esau settled in the hill country of Seir. Esau is Edom. These are the descendants of Esau, ancestor of the Edomites in the hill country of Seir. These are the names of Esau's sons, Eliphaz, son of Ada, the wife of Esau, Reuel, the son of Esau's wife, Basemuth. The sons of Eliphaz were Taman, Omar, Sappho, Gatham, and Kenaz. Timna was a concubine of Ephaz. Esau's son, she bore Amalek to Eliphaz. These were the sons of Ada, Esau's wife. These were the sons of Reuel, Nahat, Sarah, Shama, and Misa. These were the sons of Esau's wife, Basemuth. These were the sons of Esau's wife, Oholibama, daughter of Anna, son of Sibel. She bore to Esau, Jaush, Jalam, and Korah. These are the clans of the sons of Esau, the sons of Eliphaz, the firstborn of Esau. The clans Taman, Omar, Sappho, Kenas, Korah, Gatam, and Amalek. These are the clans of Eliphaz, the land of Edom. They are the sons of Ada. These are the sons of Esau's son, Reuel. The clans Nahat, Sarah, Shamma and Misa. These are the clans of Reuel in the land of Edom. They are the sons of Esau's wife, Basemuth. These are the sons of Esau's wife, Aholibama. The clans Jaush, Jalam and Korah. These are the clans born of Esau's wife, Aholibama, the daughter of Anna. These are the sons of Esau, that is Edom. And these are the, their clans. These are the sons of Seir, the Horite, the inhabitants of the land, Lotan, Shobal, Sibion, Anna, Dishon, Esur, and Dishan. These are the clans of the Horites, the sons of Seir in the land of Edom. The sons of Lotan were Hori and Heman, and Lotan's sister was Timna. These are the sons of Shobal, Alvan, Mahanahat, Ebal, Shafo, and Onam. These are the sons of Sibion, Aya, and Anna. He is the Anna who found the springs in the wilderness as he pastured the donkeys of his father Sibion. These are the children of Anna. Dishon and Aholibama, daughter of Anna. These are the sons of Dishon, Hamda, Eshba, Itra, and Karan. These are the sons of Esu, Bilal, 
Savan and Akan. These are the sons of Dishan, Us and Aaron. These are the clans of the Horites, the clans Lotan, Shabal, Sibion, Anna, Dishon, Esur and Dishan. These are the clans of the Horites, clans, clan by clan in the land of Seir. These are the kings who reigned in the land of Edom before any king reigned over the Israelites. Bela, son of Beor, reigned in Edom, the name of his city being Dinaba. Bela died and Jobab, son of Sarah of Basra, succeeded him as king. Jabab died and Husham of the land of the Tamanites succeeded him as king. Husham died and Hadad son of Bedad who defeated Midian in the country of Mawab succeeded him as king, the name of his city being Avit. Hadad died and Samla of Masreka succeeded him as king. Samla died and Saul of Rehoboth on the Euphrates succeeded him as king. Saul died and son of Akbar died and Hadar succeeded him as king. The name of his city being Pau, his wife's name was Mehetabel, the daughter of Matrat, daughter of Mesaba. These are the names of the clans of Esau according to their families and their localities. By their names, the clans Timda, Alva, Jatet, Oholibama, Ella, Pinon, Kenas, Teman, Midsar, Magdiel, and Iram. These are the clans of Edom, that is Esau, the father of Edom, according to their settlements in the land that they held.